how to add structures. Okay, create new world except click on your keyboard Z and zero. And then you create your new world, it will be a good world. Well, not a good world, it'll be a cave world. Like this, so you must dig down and then add your shipwreck. So I'm gonna make a shipwreck. You can make whatever you want. So skip to four minutes and 10 seconds if you want to skip the shipwreck building. Uh, otherwise, you should watch me build a random shipwreck for no reason whatsoever. So first of all, you have to dig a hole and then get this and this and inside the shipwreck there is always loot so we will add blocks lapis diamonds and gold <clears throat> no wait not diamonds we will need lapis and iron so now we also need stairs and so building the frame of the ship along with the back and then now that we have the back there are two floors to it so we should add that and then the stairs <clears throat> now on top we should add a flagpole And then we will need wool. And then back here add some lapis blocks, iron blocks. And then here add a gold iron and lapis and then the shipwreck we need this thing the trapdoor to block out this part <clears throat> and then you can expand the front of it This is our shipwreck, so it's not a very good shipwreck, but it will do because right now we are just adding some stuff. Also, in a shipwreck, there's always like water, so we'll need to fill up the bottom part with water. Here we will add a layer of water Okay, so now that we have a layer of water we're all good and we can go back up next this is important okay so in order to do this successfully you must go to the top of the build where you see you can't mine anything <clears throat> and you must stand here and then click O and then save and copy the code and then get out of full screen see inside go to the processor sprite and then go to the list called assets and then type in um type in what i type this is your save code
Now this, this is your where we are going to add the block. So it's just like normal. So let's copy and paste the barrier block. If you haven't watched last time's episode, you should because it's helpful for adding blocks. So we change the block ID by one. Then we change it to spawn shipwreck. And then this block is not standable. And then this block will be zero, means it cannot be mined, like this. And then down here, n n zero five means it's a block, just like up here. Oh no, twelve. Twelve means it's a spawn egg. So next, you can set this to nine o five or whatever costume. 909 for me for you it should be something barrier block 916 so for me it's gonna be 909 because that's the costume then down here it should be 275 always so now that we have this Oh, down here is the crafting, can be 275, doesn't have to be it. So now that we have this, we can change this to value to 4 for miscellaneous, and then save the project. And then if you go to full screen, test it out, wait about 7 seconds. 6 to 7, depending on your computer, and then we have to go to miscellaneous. Down here you'll see it says spawn shipwreck, and then we place the spawn egg back up, make sure it doesn't affect us, and then if it's not loading, then that's because you have to activate it on load. So, down here it says N, type in G. G stands for activating it. So if we generate once more, you'll see that it will work. So wait again. And then spawn it again. Oh, and another thing. You have to remember one important um, thing in all of these spawn eggs. Since you see this one is a spawn taiga village farmhouse, here this value is negative 20. It's just like the block ID but negative. So here <clears throat> the negative 20 is right after the 12. So for here we have the Oh, wait, hold on. And so here. So here we have to add the 12. Sorry. And then here is the negative 20. But since it's negative, it has to be negative 21. So now if we go to here, we can spawn it back up. And you'll see the lighting's trying to take place, and that will spawn in the shipwreck. It's a full shipwreck, so you can see the entire thing here. There's also the water under it, so it's a success. Now, if you spawn it near water, it will look very nice. So, spawn it in water. Oops, I guess the water didn't overlap. Anyways, inside and it all works out. So, that is how you add structures to this.